let's make sure everything works so it doesn't mess up. Yep, okay, good. Looks like things are working. Let's go here to the YouTube to make sure that we're good. All right. So uh, I'm going to be sending out some links and putting links in the description for any of your favorite content creators who have accounts on YouTube that they post on. Uh, I'll try to post all of those into the description. If you got one, let me know. I will. Uh, if you're competing and you uh, have YouTube, I'll put it in the link in the description. What is up, guys? How are you doing? We have an amazing set of matches today. And look up here. We got the whistle thingy. Th this means it actually will work this time. Unlike last time, where it didn't work. They fixed it on Monday, the day after the tournament, so eh, it's better than nothing. Uh, thank you to Gob out here, uh, making sure that we can spectate the tournament and have a good time. What is up? How are you doing, Simo? Bye-bye, man. El Loco. Always the first. I appreciate it. I'm going to go ahead and make sure that these guys get their links in the description real quick. And uh, then I'll start sending links out myself to Discord to let everyone know what's going on. Let's see. Oh, well, that's awkward. I don't know how to do that then. Um, I might have to do this after. So after, everyone will have their links in the description. So, uh. If you want to know what their YouTube channels are, I know Tuzak, uh, I know Rascals got YouTube channels, so we'll uh, get all those, and uh, we'll have them in the links to the description. So uh, come back, and you will know. We don't want to wait. Um, I understand. I'm not playing, buddy. Uh, we are actually doing a tournament live, and uh, I'm here to make sure that everyone gets in properly. And uh, so I'm gonna start nine minutes early sorry <laughs> also have to send links out so everyone will know but uh it will start in nine minutes if you don't want to wait that's fine i do understand so uh the teams are really good right now so we have already confirmed a jug team a rascals team blood hunters high reef gaming brazooka swat gene is here with a nice team right there that's going to be crazy. Oh, playing as Demon. Okay, let's see who that is. I wonder if it's Demon. Uh, oh, Wife of Trash Hacker. That is Annie. She will be playing today. So that's a good one uh, to watch out for. And 6-9, uh, that is a very underrated team out there. So uh, definitely interested to see what happens with them. So uh, we already got some of the best teams in the game here. We got Tactic Move coming in. They're going to get them a fourth person. They're all ready. So even if they can't find a fourth, It'll give them one. So uh, we we okay. We got N F or uh, N W F C. They're probably gonna make it. I don't know. I don't know if what Groff's doing. But we already have all of the teams, guys. So uh, this this is our, all the best teams in Europe, Brazil, and uh, North America. They're all coming for this because they know we're live streaming it and they want to give you a show. The third place qualifier match will be best of five. The finals will be best of seven, and we're hoping for a Rascal Hyrie three match where Tuzak got a six at once last time, and some of those games are so close, and uh, it, it's going to be great. Annie is making you triggered? Nah, man. I just didn't know that she was already on a team, but I'm ha I'm happy for it, man. What is up, Johannes? Krish? What is up, everybody? Uh, how are you doing, Amoff Warrior? I'm going to have to figure out something other than Amoff. I might just call you Warrior. But, uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, you already got a team, baby. Uh, you were picked up, so you, you didn't even have to wait for matchmaking. And there's your countdown up in the top right for everyone. I think I can zoom in on it. Okay, sorry. I don't know things. But uh, so there's there's your countdown. Uh, we are not joining the tournament since I can spectate it. That is illegal, so we will not be doing that. But uh, I am going to be sending out some links to this video, though. Uh, that way people know what's going on. And uh, I think we're going to have a great video today, guys. Some unbelievable games are about to happen. And uh, AK from the Elevate team, he is actually playing for Rascal today. Uh, they changed it up a little bit. They are actually playing with AK. Um, 
I don't know if a lot of you know this, but one of the undefeated teams back in the day was Elevate, and that is AKA Kershikov or whatever uh, from that Elevate team. So he is coming back to play for Rascal today. So that's an exciting update. So uh, it, a bunch of good things are happening. And then you have Hyreth Gaming, Tuzat, Jules, Apex, Rob. Great teams. Anyone want to beat me? <laughs> Baby, you played two games against me. It's not fair. All right, so does anyone have any... Uh... Okay, good. Just made sure if anybody here needs help with uh, Challenger Mode. How are we going to watch today? Uh, I actually have it uh, right here in the top corner. I can't zoom in on Gob because Gob doesn't allow that. But it's this whistle thing. It shows me who's in a lobby and it shows me who's in a battle. And I can choose who to watch. Yep, that is, that's exactly what that is for Firex from uh, the Elevate team. But that was quite, was quite a while ago, so I don't know if everyone even knows who that is now. But uh, for those of you who do know, that's an exciting development for sure. Uh, yeah, they uh, fixed the icon thing. They fixed the problem with uh, the spectate that we had last time on Monday. The tournament was on Sunday, but hey, you know, better than nothing. I I'm good with it. Uh, because this will allow us to do this every single week. Um, you technically have three minutes, Gundeep. You can, you can sign up, or you have like five minutes. You have enough time, Gundeep. Uh, we will be on a 30 to 40 second delay, so if I can't answer your questions, sorry, and during the games, I'm not going to answer questions. I will be mostly focused on what's going on. So, uh, I do want to make that clear. Uh, we have to be on a 30 to 40 second delay. Otherwise, it's unfair for the competitors because someone could watch the stream and know what the other team's doing. So, uh, just just an update on that. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and send these links out real quick. And uh, we'll get started pretty soon. Uh, we'll go back to the countdown. And that way we'll know. And uh, like I said, we already have a bunch of teams in. Uh, pretty excited to see what they end up doing on that. Uh it's going to it's going to be a good one guys and again the two top ranked teams right now are Hyreth Gaming and Rascal in this tournament anyways uh so they will be on opposite sides of the bracket and so as they can make it through Gene AK47 which is SWAT but they're really AK47 uh actually I don't think they like me saying that so uh they're SWAT 7 but um <laughs> but uh they have Ferone Doc, uh, I actually don't know who's on their team, to be honest. Uh, Ferone, Doc, uh, Versace, and Lushik. I don't know who Lushik is, but that, that's not going to be a bad team. So, uh, as long as they can make it through all that. Okay, Tactic Move picked up a fourth. And, uh, oh, they got their full team here today. So, that is a full Tactic Move team. Uh, okay, we're going to have some games today, guys. Like, these are going to be good. Um, and hopefully it will come out to be a uh, Jules Vindication. He had a headache the last time he played. He didn't want anyone to know because he's that kind of guy. Makes no excuses. But uh, it, it's going to be great. And what is up, Jay? And uh, also, I didn't really say hey, but hey, hey, gun deep. Uh, but yeah, guys, so uh, everything's going to start here in about two minutes. And we're going to go ahead and make sure we get all those links out. Sorry about that. Uh, and then make sure I pause that. There we go. But it, it's gonna be kind. Of, it's gonna be a little crazy. But uh, we're we're gonna figure out how this system works real quick. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can just watch anything. But uh, uh, think I might have to like click a button or two. But um, uh, either way, it, it's a pretty simple system. The the instructions were terrible, by the way. Like it's like that Chinese made furniture, you know, like where like they give you these instructions, kind of suck. <laughs> but I think that's just because it's pretty easy. I should be able to figure it out. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and send to my server the link, and then I'll send it everywhere else. But So if you're in multiple servers and you're getting at everyone, I am sorry. Just want to put that out there. TRF Tournament Live. 
All right. So, uh, oh, wait. So, you, you and Rascal might not be in different halves, I just saw. Uh, uh, oh, okay. TCMV and Brazookas do have a high rating, and that is the full TCMV rate. They're right. High Ruth Gaming may not be bracketed on the other side. Someone just pointed that out, and uh, they are right. Tyrus Gaming may have to play Bazookas early. Um, that's uh, that's an interesting development. But as you see here, we got best of three everywhere until you got the finals of best of seven, and you have the third, fourth place match, which is best of five. So, uh, but yeah, uh, I don't know. I think Brazookas might actually be ranked higher than Hyreth. I am not sure on that. Um, because they've won Brazil more than anyone. So, they, uh, I'm not sure how that's going to work. Seeding happened? Okay. So, you have Brazookas versus Tactic Move on one side. You have Hyreth over here. Where is Rascal? Rascal's over there. Uh, you will have Rascal meeting G or yeah, Rascal and Hyreth are gonna meet on separate sides. No, okay, so they will if they make it everywhere, they will be able to go to different sides of the bracket. So that's good. What is up, Ashwini? Uh, sorry if I pronounced that wrong. <laughs> uh, I'm trying, but uh. Oh, you're playing Jug first round. That that's kind of rough. Uh, SWAT's playing High Reef first. I know what we're watching. Go to this game. All right. So we're definitely watching this game. Settings. Right there. We're not doing chat. There. Close that tab. Uh, let's see. And we'll go to the game. We'll go to spectate mode. Okay, cool. We can go to anything we want. We are going to SWAT High Reef. Accept invite. Oh, it actually works. Can you guys believe that? It works. Oh my god, this is going to be great. You have SWAT versus High Reef in the first game of the day. And everything worked. Gods of Boom, I appreciate you. Great job. Love it. And I am doing great, buddy. Uh... Annie, I'm sorry you're playing Jug, but good news, we're watching this game, so we don't have to see you do that. I, I almost uh, want to pop over and watch uh, TCMB versus Brazookas. We will do that if this game isn't close at all. Uh, so, uh, I wonder if I can type here. No, I'm not going to do that, but I think I can. So, that's neat. Uh, just make sure that I'm a spectator. Uh... I'm a referee. Okay. Invite a spectator. Me. <laughs> what the hell? All right. Uh, I guess referee's fine, right? Oh, uh, hopefully it lets me just be whatever I need to be. Um, I guess I can... I, th I think it'll work. Well, we'll see. But it is weird I can invite people to spectate. <laughs> What is up, Subber Heat? How are you doing, buddy? We have an insane match for the first one of the day. I can't believe we got this lucky. Um, do I have to make it go? Battle? Oh, oh, I got, I got, a, I got a ready up too. That's kind of weird, right? <laughs> Thank you, Jules, for saying something. What is up? How are you doing, Marlo? And yes, guys, it works. We can follow everyone. Uh, so Apex wants to be shown so much. I guess we'll start out with him. Let's see what he does. Oh, him and Rob doing a good double up top. Oh, and they're going to hit Doc. Apex gets him. Rob's going to go make sure that they get anyone that's in the saloon. And they get the hill. Tuzak with a triple kill. Let's go see what he's doing. Tuzak and Jules posted up. Oh, my God. Uh, they Are you serious? They have no points. Okay. Um. Uh, Tuzak and I don't see how anyone's gonna stop Tuzak and uh, Jules. That might be the best sniping combo there is. I mean, other than maybe Tuzak and Armenia, but uh, let's see how they're gonna fight back from this. Verone, he can fight back from anything. 
let's see what his tactics are going to be. And his tactics are going to just be overwhelmed. I mean, what is he even supposed to do? He's got two of the best snipers in the world on the other side, just picking everyone off like it's nothing. And then you have Apex and Rob running in their spawn. I think we might go to the Brazookas match after this one because uh, I don't see this changing. <laughs> but let's keep our eye on Tuzak. He's coming out with full help. Let's see. Okay, they actually fought off the spawn kill. Oh, Farone, he accidentally shoots his rocket there. But that's fine. Uh, and let's see. Who's alive? Okay, you got... Oh, that's an interesting choice. Jules chooses to run with an icebreaker. That's definitely different from what I'm used to seeing. But... Uh, and also remember, a lot of these players play on an iPad Pro, which has a 120 frame rate. And when they play in these tournaments, it gets shot down to 50 frames. So that, like, imagine if you have your uh, phone at 60 frames and you go to 30 and how just disorienting that is. They're going through that. I know Tuzak and Jules specifically are going through that. But it doesn't seem to phase their sniping one bit. And Rob just killing it with the guns, man. He's just running in their spawn at will. And look at this flank. That flank is beautiful. That right there is teamwork. You know the Apex is calling it out, telling Rob to go around, and he does. And that was beautiful. He just changed direction. That's how you know it was a call out, and he goes around and does it beautifully. Great job, guys. And this is mastered. Oh, okay. This is why they have come back. Jules is not playing. They've been playing three before. That makes sense. And uh, Rob is just going off. He, he's gotten killed by Doc Sniper there. But what are you supposed to do? And Tuzak's able to get the kill. Okay, Jules is back. So Hyreth is not out of it yet. Okay, good. And you always want both teams to have everyone. Jug one. I'm sorry, baby. And congratulations, Jug, of course. And Rob over here just going insane. And, oh, and he saved his rocket for the end. What a beautiful move. He almost got a double kill with it. That was nice. Uh, 336 to 1201. Jug's a very good team. What can you say? But I think we will go and check into a game that's a little less dominant. Um, statistics, uh, let's see. Um, okay, so let's... I don't know that I can choose another one. Uh... Yeah, I think I have to stick with... Or no, okay, this is the only one that's happening right now, so uh, I'm going to leave room. You will not be able to return after you quit the match. Are you sure you want to quit? Uh, yes, I am sure I want to quit. All right, so fights and lobbies. Well, we'll see what happens. Re re refresh. Okay, so SWAT and Hyreth Gaming are back. Let's go ahead and go to the leaderboards and see what's going on with the uh, teams real quick. And we'll see who we're going to be watching next. So, Brazookas and... Uh, okay, so their game two is running, it says. Uh, here we go. Okay, there we go. Uh, do you guys want to see Gene or do you guys want to see Tech Move versus Brazookas? Both of those games should be fairly even. Uh, Gene won the first one where they win it by. Nope, that game's not even at all, so probably not going to do that one. But the two Brazilian teams, that one should be good. Oh, okay, I vote this one. So I, I think I think we should watch this one. 1,000 to 941, that's a crazy game right there. All right, let's let them know they're on stream. What's up? You're on stream. <laughs> Great game, last game. <laughs> Go ahead and let them know they earned it. Because, uh, oh my god, look at that. All of them have 300 ping. That's interesting. <laughs> How does that even work? <laughs> but we will find out pretty soon. And uh, I'm pretty excited to find out. Because this, these are two of the best teams in Brazil. And they will be facing each other on Europe Post. I am really curious to see what that looks like. I'm going to go ahead and send uh, a a everyone to the uh, Brazil, or not Brazil, but uh back-to-back -back server real quick. Uh, just got to make sure I go to the right one. Okay, they're ready, so we'll hit battle.
Back to back has two servers for some reason, so gotta make sure I hit the right one. Five, yep, I think this is four, it. Uh, three, two, uh, where are we going? General. Okay. Well, here we go. We're gonna start off, and let's go with my buddy Cal Patria. Let's see how they're gonna go. And a common tactic that I've noticed is they all go left every time. Uh, I think I've seen him go right before. Oh, and he gets done. Okay. A uh, pretty dominant TCMV uh, rush there. And, oh, okay, so you have, uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, CRRGXMR. We're going to call him Mussolini because that's who he is, so we're going to call him Musso. Musso's being dominant over here, bringing his team back from a pretty dominant start. But Musso kills everybody, and Cal L finishes it off. And we got a lot of low people, but Cal's going to come out, try to do what he can for his team. Trying to drag Matt's back in, but Matt still gets the kill. Let's see what Easy's doing over here. He's running their spawn. He does not get the kill right away. But, oh, Scree actually gets a double kill with the rocket before he dies. Cal L going off with 93 points. Oh, let's stay with him for a little while, see what he can do. Uh, it is best of three. Um... Uh, yeah, so basically, this game was really close, and the other game was not, so we switch. But, uh, because I would rather watch a close game than a dominant game. So we watched one, but, uh, the last game for this was not 1,990 or something crazy. So, uh, definitely one to watch, and Cal L almost getting the triple kill, but Royce, uh, Warris is able to stop him. Worse is dead, but he did stop him at least. So Pippa Fan over here doing a great job going for that double kill. He actually gets him there, but Blue Marys is able to stop him. And then you have over there Mussolini doing his work. He was on my pro team for a little bit actually, and he was one of the best rushers I've seen in the game. Uh, so definitely one to watch there. And that's why him and Cal are just doing work. Cal actually dies there, but he still has 178 points. But this is still a close game. But you have so many people low right here together. That is definitely going to be a double kill. And can Easy make it a triple, though? No, he gets stopped. Okay, Cal Alt runs in there and cleans it up, though. And both teams basically have full health, but they're on a little bit of a size advantage for uh, Berserkers right now. He knows his... Uh, oh, wow, that was smart. He knows that his... Uh, Ranger is going to take a, take care of it, so he runs away, and Brazookas wins in a close game, and I think that will close out their series. Cal L with a 200-point lead. Great job. And, uh, baby, you did amazing. Jug is a very hard team to beat. It is not just you that has trouble with them. So. Uh, this is the only game that's currently running as a fight, so we will go and join them midway. Oh, and it's a close one, too. Okay, good. Oh, Oma's playing. He is one of my clan members. I love you, Oma. I assume that's, like, not fake gene, so. And uh, he dies to a head glitch. That is actually a beautiful head glitch, and you got a triple off of it. Okay, Goku. That was one of the best head glitches I've ever seen since that. Oh, my God. Is that Jose playing on another account? Like, that... That was a very impressive head glitch right there from Goku. That might be a team to watch in the future rounds of this tournament. That was that was a very close game, and he did work and stopped it. Okay, so <laughs> Bloodhunters versus High Reef Gaming. Um, we might watch that one. Uh, we'll see what else we got. Brazookas versus Rascal. I think we got to watch that one. What is up, Abril? I'm doing great. And what is up, Jose? How are you doing, buddy? Uh, I, I think this is the one we gotta watch. You're on stream. I just want to go ahead and let them know, you know. Feels weird to not let them know. Uh, so everyone but Spazy over here has a great connection for Rascal. Uh, no one on Brazookas has a good connection, and Pip Fan is actually not there, his connection says. So, uh, uh, great job against TCMV. J 
just going ahead and letting Pacheo know he did good. And I'm going to make sure I pay attention so I can hit the button. <laughs> Uh, God tournament. I'm gonna also talk to you. Yeah, and every Sunday we got it. They fixed it to where I can do it. And every Sunday we will uh, play like every match is that you can be there fun. Who is that gold four guy? Um, I don't know. Uh, gold four. Oh, that is AK Krishnikov. He is actually from the Elevate team. He is a. Uh, Back when they were winning and everything, uh, they changed the rules to where everyone had to be from the same uh, region. So uh, he couldn't play, so they picked up Judas. But he is one of the best players there is. And so... Oh, you can't hear me? Okay, well, that... Wait, so what's wrong with my mic? Is that just Annie, or is that everyone? Because uh, on my end, it says that I am talking. Okay, that's weird, but whatever. Uh, so yeah, we're uh, going strong. But let's see what happens. Our, okay, Lord Beerus just going off as normal. Uh, Armenia, they took Armenia out pretty easily. That is why they probably picked up uh, Muso. He is one of the best rushers there is. And okay, so Kyle able to get AK as well. And Spazy just doing work. This guy is one of the most underrated players in the game. He is probably one. I think he is the best rusher in the game. But uh, Lord Beerus normally steals his thunder. But I think he's one of the best. And Beerus trades. And Armenia is able to take easy out after that, though. Armenia very low, though. And Spaze is just sitting up in their top, just waiting to see people. Okay. And Spaze is going to try to save A. But he doesn't know if his teammate has it. His teammate's got it. And Spaze is just trying to stay full health so he can keep this A hill and keep a two cap. Even if he's not necessarily doing much, it is an important role. And thank you very much, Ecstasy, for letting me know. Uh, and Easy's actually able to cap A over here. And, oh, he is running into a death storm over there. That was Mussolini. And he gets a double. Spazy is just too good, man. It, it's so hard to play against this guy. Oh, can he actually manage to get that triple? He doesn't get the triple, but he gets the elimination streak with no health. What? <laughs> that guy is so good. I'm telling you guys, he is one of the best rushers in the world. And I stand by that with everything. Oh, uh, and also I will be linking all of these guys have YouTube channels and they have like 30 subscribers. So I'll be linking those in the description after it's done. So make sure you come back and you go subscribe to those guys. They deserve it. Uh, and Armenia getting the double kill as always. And he's just going over to see, thankfully. For his team because they need to keep the stew cap up he can't they can't let up the pressure this brazooka's team is no joke and they are the best team in brazil for a reason and they picked up mussolini which is a great addition uh lord beerus low over there can spazy save him from pippa fan he can't but he does end up getting pippa fan and it works out for the team so i think ak somehow got him but that's fine too and uh they are able to get the victory over Brazookas right there. And uh, and getting anywhere near Brazookas is hard, but uh, they, they had it there for a minute. Just, they let it slip out of their hands. Uh, let's see what we got going on right now. All right, so... One second. Add everyone. Yep. All right. So, let's see where we can get going. Uh, Blood Hunter. It looks like Blood Hunters and uh, High Reef Gaming are going. So, let's see what they can do. There we go. I was on top of the world after getting two triples against Rascal. You should be, bro. They're, they are too good. You, you definitely should be very happy about that. Okay, so let's let's follow Tuzak. Let's see what he starts off doing. He is going to be sniping, having a dragon fire. It's always going to be Quicksilver. And he's going to go take everyone on the left side. I don't think he realizes there's three people, though, and they take out Tuzak quick. Oh, that might have been a good strategy. Let's see. Apex already died in the hill. 
but you have Jules over on the right holding it down, and Rob comes up behind. He's able to get the hill while two. Oh, God. That is so brilliant. So Rob gets the hill while you have Jules over here to stop everyone. And Jules actually kills him with the fire, or not firefly, but yeah, it's firefly. But uh, sorry, I don't, I hate that gun so much. <laughs> uh, but I use it all the time since I usually have to main snipe, but I really hate that gun. So Rob over here with 99 points. Let's see what darkness can do. Okay. Let's come out of the gate. What can he do? He will be trying to scout, and he is just met with too much pressure. There's really nothing he can do here, and it's rough. Uh, playing against this team, I am very excited to see a finals between a High Wreath Gaming and a Rascal. These teams are playing at the top of the game, man. I don't know how you play better than this. You have a back-to-back -back and jug team mixed with Rascal on this side, so... I don't know much that you can do better. Muso Sniper is a lose 100%. <laughs> I told him every time Rusher is not a sniper. He is a great rusher, though, right? But he took out one of the best snipers in the world as a rusher, so. So, I mean, he's doing something right, Jose. But, uh. Okay, so let's see what Tuzak's going to do over here. Uh, everyone over there is going to die. Oh, and he's got a rocket for him. Good call out saying everyone's low. Tuzak rockets the hill. And he's able to get that guy on the left as well for a perfect aim. Can he get a triple kill, though? That's what's that's what we remain to be seen. And he doesn't know where they are, so he can't. But Rob's going up the back. Can't, or uh, Actually, Apex is going around the back. <laughs> Rob's going up front. Jimbo gets a double kill on Jules and Apex. What a play. He ends up getting killed by Rob, though. They're chasing Tuzak out. Nugs is going to have to fight Rob. But it's not 1v1. Oh, Rob's able to get the kill, though. And Rob's Orion is so lethal, and just honestly, Orion is the worst thing to play against if someone's good at it. It's so, it's so like just devastating at long range, especially in pro play. So if you're good at aim off uh, Orion, play pro play. And Hyreth Gaming pulls out the second game. Let's see what other games we can watch right now, and hopefully we can uh, get some good ones. Let's go find what Gene's doing. Uh, I'd like to see. I'd like to see what Gene's doing if we can. Uh, we can finish off that game against Rascal and Brazuka. See just the end of it. Okay. Uh, it could be a lot worse. Um, let's go see what Pivfan can do. So he's gonna come out on the right side. Let's see what he can do. He's got two guys on the right, but he actually killed one of them. He's still got two to contend with. Beerus is able to snipe him. And Beerus getting a double kill right there. Let's follow him for a second. Can he get the triple? He can't, but he's going to try to finish that kill off when he comes around. And can he do it? He gets him really low. He sees it, all of them are low. So this might be an interesting multi-kill opportunity. Can Muso take it, though? Oh, Muso doing a great job coming around. He does get both of them, but it isn't a double kill because he killed them after he was dead. Pippa Fan comes out into Spazy Sniper. Or, wait, are all of Rascal snipers doing sniping? <laughs> okay. Um, I've never seen that before, but uh, I think that all of Rascal was sniping there. That's an interesting thing. Uh, yeah, I mean, the, the I guess Spazy switched, but okay. That, that's definitely interesting. Um. Armenia getting bottom, but Lord Beerus on top. Has Lord Beerus ever gotten anything but top? Every time I play them in tournament, he's first. <laughs> like... Oh, we got Jug versus Hyreth Gaming. We are watching this one. On stream. Alright, going ahead and letting everybody know that they're on stream. Okay, everybody with beautiful connections here except for Apex. Uh, which is to be expected. He is from North America. This is a European tournament. But anyone can join India, Brazil, North America, Europe, whatever. And I'll hit battle so I don't make everyone wait. For whatever reason, it makes me do that. Dude, this final is going to be insane. This rascal team is on top of their game. Like What they did to one of the best teams in Brazil... 
obviously Brazil has 300 ping, so we do need to take that into consideration. That is like a North American player playing on India or vice versa, which means India on North America. Uh, so uh, it, it's not super fair, but uh, I've played Brazookas and they've beaten me on my host. So uh, it's uh, that rascal team's on point, guys. Okay, so right now Jug has been pinned down, but again, it, when you had to contend against Tuzak and uh, oh, they actually outsniped Tuzak. Betrut over there using oh, Akuda got a double kill with it. That's a very very good job over there. And then Rob's taken out by an Orion, but you have Jules getting the elimination streak immediately taken out by both. I have no idea what his name is, but we're going to call him Bo. So, Apex is just dying on burn. He's on fire. No help. So, he's going to try to rush out there, get a damage for his team. He ends up getting taken out by a scout immediately, though. And Bo does not see the guy outside the door. Rob, perfect positioning. And he's just going to run in that spawn and just go try to take out everyone. Oh, man. Apex and Tuzak take all the fire. And then he comes around. Does a great job. Tuzak with a 51 point rocket. And then Apex gets his rocket for a merciless buggy able to take out Apex there. Let's see if Betroot can snipe again. Betroot, Betroot is crazy with this Kuda. I mean, this is no, not a joke. The, this team he's playing against. So to take people out like that. Apex able to get a double kill and stem right before the rocket. He saw the rocket come out and hit a stem. That was beautiful use of one of his three stems. And that is what separates like people that are just really good from the top guys. Is you know when to use your three stems. You know when to use your one rocket. And just to be clear, these this jug team has a lot of top guys on it. So, But uh, that was beautiful work by Apex. Uh, and you just have him in a slaughter field. I mean... I have no idea how you're supposed to handle this. Two top-tier rushers and two top-tier snipers. Oh, you're right, Henry. That was a very smart rush. How many till the finals? I don't I don't actually know, but we'll, we can find out. Um, actually, I should go ahead and cancel out of this match so it doesn't mess things up real quick. Uh, there we go. Make sure that we're here. Okay, so uh, let's see where we're at. Uh... We don't want to be there. So right now we have Rascal waiting for this team to play. What's going on? Okay. Uh, I think we need to either force one of the teams to win or force them to start restart. Because they've been playing for 20 minutes. If they don't have a result, I don't know what to do there. Uh Hold on, I'm going to make sure that I uh, don't have messages from that. Uh, why are we not invite for third match? Okay, um, okay, I will check. All right, let's fix this real quick. Who won? Right, I'm going to go to that team, that game's chat, and see if I can fix this. All right, so, who won? The second match. All right, guys, I got to get their round three going. My bad. Dude, they are in the best shape ever. Uh, my team is obviously High Reef Gaming, for those that do not know. Uh, but um, I can't play when I do this, so uh, Tuzak is playing for him. Start Jean's game. I can't start Jean's game. I have to find out who won the second match. Um, because whoever won the second match, uh, I have to force a win, but I don't know who won. So I can't force one team to win. We, all right. Both teams agree. Well, if they, uh, I can't just force a win because one team says they won. Dude, I understand Flarex. Well, I'm fixing it. All right. So, force win. 69 1. Yes. Okay. Back to tournament. So, matches 1 to 1. Okay. 
And then, so, do you guys want to see that match or the High Reef match? And I am sorry, Flarex. I I'm sorry. But, let's see, what else do we got here? Uh, well, I understand it's in your recents, bro. I don't have you added on my friends list. <laughs> but, uh, so, there we go. They contacted me a few minutes ago. I was in the middle of the match. But, I got it going now. Uh, and I apologize for the wait for uh, Gene. But, we are going to go back into the game so we can start looking at who's playing. Okay, so, uh, I actually don't think... I think that the jug thing's over. So, we're going to go here. All right. You're on stream. There we go. Oh, wait, what the fuck? Oops. All right, that didn't work. That's my bad. So, uh, let's see. Let's go fix that. Oops. Uh, so here... Discard. That was my fault. I apologize to all those teams. Because that was not their fault. So, basically what happened is I accidentally hit battle when they weren't ready because I'm a moron. My bad. It's one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, uh, so they're going to play each other and uh, I accidentally made them start their game too early. So, uh, I'm just going to leave that game alone and go to this one. Uh... Okay, so the reason I forced the win, I made sure that both teams agreed. The game messed up, basically. Yeah, no, I, I understand that, Flarex. Uh, I fixed it. Yeah, I, I understand, I understand uh, that I already reset their game. Don't worry. And this is actually a really close game. Okay. And Jug is actually on the upper hand here. They have a 2-1. Oh, and Batroot over there actually takes them out. Tuzak's able to sit in the B-Hill, but I don't know that he's able to take it. He isn't. He gets out, but Rob is able to trade spots with him. That was a brilliant move, and that'll actually get them the victory. But that was a very close match. Hey, I'm trying here. My bad. Don't worry. I reset their match. They're fine. <laughs> but, uh... Th they're good. Uh, I think... They should, as long as they got their invites. Um, all right, so are they anywhere on here? Uh, and let's go to the tournament site real quick and make sure that they're playing their game. Uh, their game did start, I am fairly certain. So, uh, we're going to just stay away from that. I think since I've already been in their game, I don't get to go in again. So we will just go back to it. Uh, so, yeah, we kind of have to wait for them. But we can see what the bracket looks like and see where everyone is at. Gene will play next uh, after this tournament or after that game is done. We might watch that. I don't know who's actually playing right now. But uh, again, I am sorry for that. Uh, Eldarin just messaged me saying that that team's having that problem. But uh, Gene will play this team. Okay, so the match failed. Okay. Go here. So the match failed. I don't know how. if the match fails, what do I do? All right, so. Let's see discard I guess I, I don't know what to do if the match fails um no agree no I, I agree it, don't worry about it we're fixing it all right so I think that the match failed because they didn't they think that they're I, when I reset the match, I think they didn't want to go in. Okay, so it's working now. Okay. They discarded that game to start a new one. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Goku is not in. Okay. 
Okay, so they have a player that's not there. That is what happened. Uh, yeah, so basically, one of their players hasn't been there, so they keep resetting it. Yeah, I, I can't help that. Like, if go okay, Goku's there. So Goku's there. The last time was my fault, though. But the other times is not. <laughs> so we'll watch this. It'll be done. Yeah. Okay. There we go. See, everything's fine. As soon as they're all ready, then we'll hit it. Battle. Okay. Hey, it's a learning process, guys. It's the first time. But, uh, and I don't know why the games didn't start. That has nothing to do with me. But, uh, I can fix it, thankfully. But they have to message me before I know. So, uh, as soon as they message me, we fixed it. So, they're playing each other. And, uh, we got Gene Oma over here, who's my clan mate, who gets, uh, killed pretty fast. But he did a lot of good things before he died. So, good job, Oma. And, okay, Goku over here is... Strafing. Oh, he's got confidence in himself to be able to do that and still take the hill. And then you got Deej, who ends up getting a trade-off right there. And then you have Ivanko getting sniped. Oh, that guy perched up there is really helping his team out. And the red team's actually able to get the hill. But who is that? That's per okay, it's Goku. And he's actually perched up there with a scout. That's interesting. Uh, he ends up running down after his team gets it. Can you get the triple kill? He can't, but... He almost got it. And, oh, Goku gets the double. Can he get the triple? That's what we want to know. And he can't either. But his teammate comes in with a rocket. Oma the double. And he also can't get the triple kill. Triple kills are hard to come by today. But that was a whole lot of double kills and a whole lot of action. What more can you want in Gods of Boom? And the blue team is going in, taking the hill with force. And I think they're able to defend it. If Goku can get this on rip, he does. Ivanko spawning to help his teammate. And the blue team is coming back hard. Oh, what a good job there. Machiavelli ends up killing him, but they trade off kills. So both of them using the porcupine. Oma with a double kill with his rocket. What a beautiful use of it. Oh, the blue team's able to still keep the hill. And this is an even match at the half. Okay, so Deej is now taking on two. Oma's on the other side, and they're more focused on Oma than the guy actually killing him. And it ends up working for Goku. He ends up getting a double. Almost gets the triple. Oh, he does get the elimination streak. Goku has done just in phenomenal work. Every time we've seen him, he's done something amazing. He did a great head glitch triple kill and then got the killing spree to keep the win on the first game. So uh, definitely nice stuff going on there. And now he ends up killing him. What can Ivanko do? Oma's right there to get the double kill with a scout. And he just moves up to the hill. They're going to try to take the hill. Oma's going to go make sure his team gets it by distracting people with an avalanche. And he's actually taking them out with this beautiful work of an avalanche and fang. And then you have Ivanko trying to push up with no help. What can he even do? And uh, his teammate gets taken out with a nice double kill. But they're able to end up taking that out. Let's see if Goku can pull some more miracles out of his hat. This is a dead even game. Goku gets another kill. And that Berserker is lethal when he gets low. It is a deadly thing. Oh, Goku is low and he does get another kill with it. Machiavelli is in there. He's got half health. Rip is sniping everybody. Oh man, Red is making a comeback when it matters because this is the end of the game. Blue is going to have to do a big push here. And Goku's dead. So I don't know who else on their team can do it. Oh, man. Red team is coming back. Oma making sure he pushes them back in the spawn so they can't do anything. And he ends up getting killed by Goku. Goku can win the game right here with a multi-kill. If he gets this next kill, Goku could win the game for his team. And red team pulls it out with a rocket at the end of the game. Oh, my God. That was nuts. Goku over here with 275. Oh, man. He almost won that game for his team, but Red Team had that rocket saved up, and it advances him to the next round to play against Gene. And uh, Gene might have their hands full with that one. Let's go look at the brackets as they are now, now that that team has finally advanced. I apologize for anyone who had to wait because of it. Uh, so right now you have Hyreath in the finals and Jug in the third and fourth place match. Uh... Sorry for any, uh, just good games. 
<laughs> that was beautiful what they did. Like, Goku, that Goku guy, uh, if he is a hacker, I'd believe it, man. That was nuts. The way he did that wall glitch was just insane. So I guess this is the only match that is actually running right now is Gene versus Dij. That will be the one we watch. And then they will play Rascal. And then you will get Jug versus probably Gene or Dij. <laughs> and then you will have your final High Reef Gaming versus Rascal. So, hey, you know what? We get to watch more games. It's never a bad thing. And let's see what happens. God, please tell me that Challenger Mode isn't screwing up again. I really hope they go back to ESL. <laughs> so it is saying it's trying to create the game, but there is no lineups. What does that mean? I wonder if this is what happened the first time. I will ask Eldarin if he can fix this. Uh, because, okay, there we go. It, it started. Lineups, okay. So it's got everybody. Okay, so I know a lot of you, are my, a lot of my subscribers are JKIM subscribers. So uh, let's watch Shake Him do some work. Uh, if it's up here. Uh, it'll come up eventually. But let's watch Jake Him do some work. Uh, and I'm sure that Flarex will let us know if it's messing up. So go to game. Uh, the timer has not started, so I don't know what that means. But I'll keep my messages open. Let's see. Uh, where are we going? Refresh, see what happens. Well, this is annoying. But it might be in just... Uh, Firex, let me... Apex, Drew plays first. Us, Rascal, or Gene, or... Um, typically the third place match goes first. Uh, is it working? No invite. Okay, I think I can do something about that. But I think Eldarin might have to. He's here, though. Uh, need help? <laughs> Gene match won't start. Luckily, being in the same clan as Jacob, I can talk to him a lot easier. <laughs> Was Challenger mode. We fixed it. <laughs> But I don't know about this one. Uh, but good news is we have L. Darren looking at it. And we are about to watch J. Kim. So it's all going to be good. We just kind of make sure that we can get the game to start. Which is kind of annoying. Okay, so the match did fail. So discard. Actually, I probably shouldn't do things because I know that L. Darren's working on it. Uh, I, I discarded it. Let's hopefully, hopefully that'll give him the match. And if it does, that'd be great. Get it now. <laughs> okay, good. Okay. And we're not going to touch anything until everyone is ready. Uh, team, his team name is Gene something. Gene, Gene, um, yeah, they spelled it with stupid stuff, so I don't know how to do it. I'm letting all Darren uh, to know that I fixed it, so don't mess with it. But I always think it's better to get him to help because uh, he knows how to do it more than I do. We need Machiavelli to start before I can hit battle. Okay, everyone has hit it. Now I will hit it. There we go. I, I, I got you, Flarex. We're, we're good. Alright, so Flarex is so active today. Let's start off with him. Now nah, we're starting off with Jake Kim. What am I, what am I kidding? J. Kim is rushing. Okay, nice. Good to see. J. Kim is an underrated rusher. Everyone knows he's the best icebreaker in the game, but people actually don't know he's also great at rushing. 
he just rushed into three people, so that's not necessarily his fault that he died. But you have Naruto over here getting a double kill. This is the wild card here. I've seen Naruto get 16 kills in a tournament against me before, and that was annoying. But, uh, but uh, so uh, I've seen him get 17 kills and 400 point or 350 points or something against bazookas. He he can go he can go nuts when you let him. So that's definitely one we want to follow as well. And he is doing the work that I always expect of him. Whenever I need a fourth, that's the first person I go to is Naruto. He knows his teammate is capping for the trip cap, so he's just defending. And this actually might not be his pushover of a game as people are going to think. Uh, although against Rascal, it does get a much harder. Uh, and they all fire rockets at everyone. Just a lot of rockets, guys. <laughs> Sometimes when you have your rocket out and you got to fire it, everyone has the same thing. Uh, wait a minute. Is that Pandrick on their team? Oh, okay. He's like my favorite person in kind. That's funny. I love Pandrick. He uh, time drops my stream sometimes. So uh, it's funny that he is actually playing in this tournament. So that's cool. I like it. And uh, Deej is able to stop him. Keep an A for his team and getting a defense kill. So we will go back to, let's see. I want to see what Naruto is still doing. Let's see if he can continue his streak. Oh, he doesn't. He gets triple killed on by Oma. Oh, can he get the four at once right here on Jkem? He he does not. His teammate steals it. But he almost did. So good job, Oma. Oma over here doing work for his team, and they may make a comeback over here. And let's see what Flarex. Flarex is dead. So let's go to Naruto. Naruto's dead. Are they just killing everybody out here? They got a two cap going for the three. Oma has a killing spree. He ends up dying to Flarex, though. And oh, Jkem expert right there with the scout. He's able to get it for his team. He needs to hide there. He needs to hide so he can cap, but he has fire coming from behind. Okay, good job. Hopefully that pork will not kill him, but his teammates are there to cap if it does. And okay, good. Good job, Jkem. But Omo over here doing work, man. Let's see what he's going to pull with this. Can he get Flarex? Oh, what a perfect grenade. Those green grenades are actually pretty good in this if you use them properly. And Oma definitely used them properly. Oh my god, that was beautiful. And then he gets Pandrick all on no health, and he's already regenerated from just health pills. He gets a killing spree on top of everything, but he gets overwhelmed by two other people. What are you going to do? And yes, Apex, you have to wait forever. And no, I probably cannot. Uh, who is Pandrick? I said Panjik. Uh, oh, Pankaj? Oh, shit. I mean, I'm trying not to cuss. I'm sorry. Uh, really? Just so you guys know, I call it Kunzut, Kuznut. Like, I get all these wrong. Pankaj, you're right. I call it, pa uh, my bad. Uh, I thought the K, and the K and J were mixed up, so I apologize to... Pankaj? Can somebody pronounce that for me so I can know? I'd appreciate it. You guys do have to realize I am born in America, so we aren't, like, super cultured. Not my fault. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but I would like to know. So, uh, good game. Oma, a uh, god. No, I probably shouldn't say things. I think I'm just not going to say stuff. Uh... I'll just say stuff to you guys. Pankaj? Okay, cool. I, I can do that. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it, Roy. Lionheart's my favorite kind player. Actually, um, I don't really interact with him very much, but he seems like a really good dude. I like Lionheart, too. He's also really skilled, too. That guy's nuts. But, uh, but um, yeah, so I like Lionheart, too. He he's a good guy. Um, I do hope to rematch him with Gunrag soon. With Gene. Uh, I know that they want to do that. Uh, Lionheart has told me that on stream. Or Punkage. Okay, I, I can do that too. Uh, I I'm, I'm, as long as I get close. I just don't want to call him Punjik again. <laughs> but we will start out with Naruto and see what they do. Naruto actually playing out here with this gun. Okay. What's his backup? Oh, it's an Orion. Okay, that makes sense. He's starting out Orion uh, Kuda. Okay, Jcam got a double to start the game, though. So that's helping his team out a lot. And he's rushing Oma. He ends up getting him. Can he get Rip, too? He almost gets the double kill, but he's able to get him. And Rip is out here. Can, he keeps the hill, though. Uh, 
Oh, okay. So Pendrick has not actually spawned yet. That's going to be rough. Uh, hopefully he will come back for the third game if they... If I don't think they can win 2v3. Like, that last game was close. But hopefully he comes back this game. Uh, they are already past the 30 second rule. So uh, just so you guys know, there is a 30 second rule. Uh, if you do not quit your whole team in the first 30 seconds, the game counts. Hundrick's back. He's got five points. Okay, it is a tie game. And uh, if you're tied when it's 3v4, I don't see that working out very good. But hey, that last game was actually pretty close. And uh, we'll see what happens. Naruto over here getting his uh, killing spree. But that has to do with a rocket and his uh, very good head glitch over there, actually. It's really hard. It's a much harder than you think to head glitch where he was head glitching at. Uh, can we play at 9.30 p.m. today? I don't know, man. I'm probably going to be worn out after this, but we'll see. And, uh, J.K.M. hunts down Oma, does a really good job for his team, and he makes sure he gets inside the hill, he makes sure it caps back, and he just pushes up with his team. Great job, bad J.K.M. over there. His teammate gets a double kill, that's Pandrick. Good job, er, you know what? Uh, Pankaj. There we go. I can do it. All right, so J. Kim pushing up behind, but he's got someone behind him as well. So Deej was in the middle. He died, but Oma, can Oma carry for the team? Naruto over here with a triple kill going for the four at once. He gets it. Can he go for a five at once? He can't. He's doing the smart thing, getting back, playing for his team and not for his kill count. But man, uh, that four at once, beautiful. Great job, Naruto. I told you, one of the most underrated wild cards in the game. And, uh... It's nice. Very good. <laughs> hey, everyone. I get it. I understand. It's just that's what I've called him for literally like three months. So, like, my brain's going to take a minute to reset. Like, no, it's not Pandrick. It's Panjek. I got the J and K mixed up like three months ago, and I just ran with it. I get it. I understand that I say it wrong. I also call Kunzut Cuznut. So, uh, I told him that he needs to change his name to Cuznut, so it's easier for everyone. <laughs> uh, and he needs to change it to Pandrick, too. Right. Naruto over there, just carrying the day, man. That four at once was beautiful for 324 points, 12 kills. His whole team really did good. Pandrick actually put up numbers for the fact that he wasn't there the whole time. Like, God you know what? I blame you guys at this point. Um, played like a god. <laughs> Oma did amazing. That that was for real, like just insane what he was what he was able to manage. Okay, so we got Gene versus Rascal now, and this is what I know a lot of you want to see because after this, you get to see good things. I I actually am not dyslexic, but I am stupid. <laughs> Fun fact. Uh, uh, what? Oh, okay, yeah, this map is definitely TDM. Okay, so, oh, Pandrick does have 656 MS. That's, um, that's gonna suck. <laughs> 365 MS from Flarex, not much better, but uh, it's actually a lot better. Um, and Naruto has ungodly internet with the 49 MS. Maybe that's why he's getting those four at once. You ever think about that? That's why I get mine. Yeah, I know you waited. I'm sorry, guys. I get it. Sorry. <laughs> Challenger mode broke. <laughs> okay, so Flarex has to hit ready up, and then Armenia, and then we will hit battle so we don't force them to play 3v3. Sure, is right. I'm not, guys. You gotta realize, like, I I'm just getting by here on minimal smarts. <laughs> Hey, I'm, I'm doing my best. And uh, it's not even my tournament. I'm actually only supposed to be doing the casting part. So I wasn't supposed to do any of the fixing brackets part. This game is broken too. <laughs> Everything is broken here. Okay, battle. If jeans win, um, that yeah, that would be interesting for sure. 
Uh, I just hope Pandrick isn't under the map. I don't know if you noticed that, but he was under the map. He was in some kind of canyon with some roads or something. Uh, so let's see what Pandrick's doing. Let's see if he's lagging around. 656 MS, and he's coming out here putting up numbers. Let's see if he can do it again. Uh, he's actually playing a thing where he's not actually going to do anything. So, okay, actually, I lied. Okay, he was playing the gatekeeper, basically. He was able to actually get a kill, too. And then he gets spacey to no help. This is not an easy thing to do. These teams are actually playing a match that might be good to see. And all of, uh, all of Rascal right here is very low. This is an easy opportunity to get a multi-kill. Lord Beerus is able to snipe Jake him. And is he able to get Pandrick as well? He is but it takes a little bit. Actually, Armenia is able to get him. Naruto coming out, getting him, but he got low from it. Spazy is low, but J.K.M.'s able to get that one. Flarex out here getting Spazy, actually. And he gets the double kill. Great job at Flarex. And remember, he's playing at 350 MS. I am definitely calling him Pan from the rest of my life. You were correct. Uh, join Jean and let Annie host. Uh, that is up to her. But uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, actually, I don't think I'm allowed to do that because it's I'm not allowed to play in these tournaments since I have the access. But uh, I appreciate the sentiment, uh, Flarex. I still will play on the Saturday tournaments, guys. Don't worry, you will still see Shuri playing in tournaments. Uh, only the tournaments that I am an admin in and I do spectating for, I don't enter because it's not very fair. Uh, so Flarex over here on Armenia. And Armenia is going to come back. Is it Flarex going to outsnipe Armenia? He's actually making Armenia retreat, and Pandrick gets him. Oh, that's interesting. Flarex is outsniping Armenia right there. Flarex is definitely a hacker. That is. We have not seen that in a long time. What is AK doing? AK is doing his job, playing his role, and him and Spazy right there doing the double kill right there. If you come around that corner, they both hit you. That is rough. Frerix actually gets Spazy. He does not get the guy who's wanting to, but he did get one of them, so that rocket was not wasted at all. This is a close game, guys. Rascal is not an easy team on this map in particular because they have some of the best snipers in the world, and that rocket from Lord Beerus making it where he can one-shot people, that was beautiful, and that rocket also will let you know where everyone is at, and so that's why he did that. It was a finder rocket kind of thing. So you know where everyone is in that area, and they're going to be low if they're there. And so that was a beautiful job. That was big brain plays right there, and Lord Beerus pulls it off great. Pandrick actually outplays Beerus uh, with 650 MS. I, I don't want to say Beerus got outplayed. It might have been lag. We don't know. So uh, don't, don't, come, don't come for me, rascal people. But um, either way, Spazy over here doing his work. Lord Beerus sniping like perfect. Flarex, let's see if Flarex can do anything with the low health, but the game's ending. So we will see what's happening next. But remember, we have a great third and fourth place match, and then we have the finals. Or we have the finals. I don't really know if we're doing the third, fourth place match. I don't really know. Uh, I will ask Elder because I don't know. Uh, so Elder, uh, actually, I might have. To force them to play we'll give it like 10 seconds if they don't get it if they don't get the invite within like a reasonable amount of time i'll go force the match to start uh are the finals paused to all right refresh all right yeah let's go let's go see what's going on go to game Wait. Oh, that's not the Rascal match, I don't think. So, so Rascal versus Gene. Here we go. View. Go to game. Okay, so it says it's going. Okay, good. It worked. I don't have to do anything. <laughs> so, we have a good game. That was a great game, actually. Uh, I'm really interested to see what happens on Atrium here. Uh, I actually have no idea what's going to happen, to be real with you. But I don't think Pandrick's here yet, so uh, we'll see. Uh, Pandrick came back with unbelievably better ping. So he is obviously cheating. I'm kidding. But uh, he has 300 less ping, so that's going to be nice for their team. 
All right, and then uh, AK is having some ping issues as well. Um, but he needs to ready up, and then we'll be ready to go. I'm just making sure... Pause to let the third place match stream first. I'm going to let L. Darren do this bit so I don't have to. So, Okay, battle. Sorry for making guys wait two seconds longer, but... It's important so I can watch this and pay attention to this while Elder and fixes the other stuff. Ow, my knee hurts a lot. Okay. So, I'm gonna follow Lord Beerus out the start and then we'll go to Jaykim. I hope you guys are cool with that. Uh, Lord Beerus gets killed pretty early, um, so it switches from him. So, Jaykim over here actually takes one. He almost gets two of the rascal guys. Armenia is able to stay alive and take C, but Flarex actually gets him. Flarex is just doing doing some work with no points, but like everything he's done actually mattered. So I, it's weird that he didn't get points for a lot of those assists. Wait, okay, so we got Armenia. Armenia's rocket actually gets two people low, but he can't capitalize because Pandrick's able to kill him before he can do anything. Spazy capitalizes off of it for him. J Kim shoots the rocket, and Naruto gets the kill, and that's good teamwork right there. AK is the only thing stopping him, and J Kim pulls off a great knife. Good job, J Kim. And Spazy coming out the gate to save the two cap of the scout. One of the best rushers in the game, like I'm telling you guys. That that's just a fact. But you have a lot of low bulls right there. That's very dangerous. Flarek's able to take out one. Pandrick takes out the other. But uh Pandrick shoots his rocket as he dies, ends up getting him. But right here, Naruto can get the double. J Kim ends up killing him. And they're going to able to tap, uh, they should be able to cap A. J Kim's going to go and just do his best to get B or, nope, he's got him defend C. He needs to help his teammate out. Panjik actually staves him off by himself and J Kim's able to get him. So their team actually has a two cap. This is not a game Rascal's going to win easily. They're doing a great job with their teamwork on uh, Gene's side. And Rascal is doing phenomenal as always, but. Gene is not giving them this game for free. It is on EU server, guys. Sorry, I can't read chat. I am just... Oh my god, Panjik using the Berserker perk to perfection. He gets low. Make sure that he shoots second, so he will be low by the time he needs to shoot. He gets the double kill. They kill Armenia. Can they take it back? Panjik CC is getting taken, but he takes him out too. Panjik over here winning the game by himself. Oh my god. That guy is nuts. He got his ping down to 300, and it is a whole new game. Let's follow Armenia, see what he can do. Can he pull something for his team? He is just being an overwatch right here for his A and B hill, making sure they keep it. Pandit gets another double kill, but Armenia is able to take him out. Naruto does take out. Oh, he's going to help j -Kim to make sure j -Kim is secure over A. That's the smart move because they have a better chance at A than they do at B. With low health, so that was a beautiful move by Naruto not to go for B. Because a lot of people would have went for B, but he, he did the smart move to help Jake him. But Beerus gets over there with his double kill, and he's able to help take it. And they're just going to hunt down the guys in their spawn. But Pantra gets a double kill. This might not be over yet. Because they only have one point, and if they can get this right here, and the, oh, Jake him's able to stay alive. Beautiful job. They have no points. They have to get this on kills. And then he gets the Blade Master. Oh, they end up getting the middle hill and they're able to kill Flarex. But that was the closest game I've seen in a long time. Beautiful job. Oh my god. Panjik is just unbelievable. That guy went from 650 ping to 300 and he just went off. Uh, if he had if he had 350 ping in that first match, I think that might have been a different ball game. Except it, it's guns, so it probably would have been a different shooting game. But uh, still, that that's so insane that he was able to pull that off there. <laughs> they almost had it back. Okay, so Jug is forfeiting the third place match. We will have the finals immediately. So Apex, you get your finals immediately. <laughs> uh, 
So I will make sure and forfeit Jug's matches for them. They have uh, Bet Root is gone, so they don't. They only have three, and so they don't want to play three before on stream for obvious reasons. But um, so I will go ahead and force quit their matches for them. Uh, Gene, great job! You got third. Uh, then uh, let's see. How do I force quit for? Uh, okay, so. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna let Eldarin do that because I'm uh, I'm not gonna screw anybody's stuff up. <laughs> uh, but we will be watching the finals. Except on stream now. Good fucking game. <laughs> because that game was nuts, right? Uh, but you guys get Rascal back to back right now. We are here. We're for it. I, I, I'm pretty excited. Uh, luckily, it's not letting me... Oh, I guess at least one person on the team has it ready for me to hit battle. I wish it wouldn't let me hit battle until everyone's ready. My Discord doesn't open. Swear. Okay. Actually, that that's between them. Not for you guys to see, I don't think. So, I think I'll just close that. But uh, I do just want to let them know they're on stream. Seems fair. Rascals are... I don't know, man, if Gene can do that to Rascal with Pandrick. And just so you guys know, Tuzik got a six at once on these guys last week. This is not an easy game. So, uh, uh, it's crazy. Go R. Okay, whatever. But, um, just so you guys know, this is not an easy game. Uh, you know what I see? I, I see a bunch of people who are picking on me because I'm stupid. Uh, Sandai is Jules, yes. Uh, he doesn't want people to know who he is, I don't think, so he changed his name a bunch. So I'm going to tell you exactly what his name is, because I'm his friend. <laughs> he needs to get better friends. Okay, so AK is not under the map anymore, that's good. Okay, so we are going to start out on Spazy. Let's see what he does here, uh, and then we'll probably go to Jules and see what Jules can get going. Spazy is, I don't know if that's lagging or if that's me having the lag issue. But Tuzak's able to take him out. Okay, Tuzak with no help. They aren't able to get the hill because the Beerus is over there sniping. But Rob is not able to get him. Okay, so let's see. What's Jules able to cap the hill by himself? He's just sitting in hill, just sitting pretty. What are they going to do? They're going to have to face Jules. That's all that they know. Oh, in the train with the one shot. Great job by Jules to kill Armenia there. Or AK, sorry. Armenia is in the hill. And he gets taken down by Tuzak. Rob right there to help Tuzak. And Lord Beerus just in the line of fire. And I told you guys, this is not an easy game. And they are coming to win. Rascal is not an automatic win in this one. They are down by a lot. But remember, Rascal is the best team in the world. And uh, that's a, that, they're that for a reason. So, uh... Let's see if they can come back. Beerus is on an elimination streak. Apex ends up taking him out right after. Getting a knife, which is good. That gives him the bonus points from the combo breaker. So that ends up being a good thing for his team. Jules able to take him out with the sniper. Can he get Beerus here on an angle? AK actually rushes in and takes Jules out. And they get the tie from a 200-point deficit. That's, that's quite the thing. And then you have Rob in the hill. Tuzak's over there. He's not able to cap it because he's being pinned down. Let's see if Jules can help him out over here. Jules is able to start getting Spazy and AK, but he knows he needs to back up and just help his team when they spawn. No reason to run in by yourself and just do nothing for your team. That's a smart thing to do. What's Armenia doing over there? But Jules is actually going to rush to the side. He knows where they all are, so he knows he doesn't have to contend on anyone on the left. Apex is able to take him out and get the double. Armenia gets an elimination streak, and you have Beerus with his rocket taking out everyone who was there. And now you're just going to have to see, can can Apex's team take out people with the diversity? The, this is where this is where good teams are made. And Apex able to take him out in the middle. And does Apex see what's going on? Uh, I think he does. He ends up killing him. Great job by Apex and Rob. A beautiful team over there with that uh, Berserker and Orion. They make a great combo whenever they're near each other. Everything dies. And Spazy's getting killed by Apex, who has no help. Oh, he ends up having Lord Beerus come and clean it up. AK ends up getting the kill up there on Jules. And Rob is just by himself. Can he do it? He does end up killing one. Can he get two? No, he can't. Armenia is sitting there. And he's going to just have to take out two Zach or Apex right here.
he's just going to flash him and just try to do something for his team. Oh, but Jules ends up getting the double on Spazy. Can he go for more? He can go for the triple. Can he go for a four at once? Four at once right there, Jules. But AK's able to shift out of it. That was a great play by AK, but Tuzak ends up getting him. And he just saves his team from a four at once, though. And that is huge right here because they cannot let him catch up. But Beerus with the double, Jules with the elimination streak, though. And he's just going to stay hill and try to get defense points, make sure his teammates can get there before the other team can take it. And this game is going to go down in the books, basically a tie so far. Oh, Tuzak gets the revenge kill, so he's going to get even more bonus points. But Beerus with the double kill in the hill, as soon as he takes it, it might be over. Jules has to not only get the hill, but he has to live, and he cannot do that. That is so insane for the first match, but it goes to at least four, and it might go to all seven after that. That was not a one-sided thing. That was a 100-point game, and that was a beautiful game. Lord Beerus, as always, first. I don't know if that guy's ever not first. I will have, after this stream, his link to his YouTube channel, which he does have. Uh, and that'll be posted for you guys. So, uh, I th uh, can you close the jug match? Yes, I can. Okay. So, Eldarin wants me to close the jug match, so I'll do that real quick. Uh, go to this jug for squad. All right, there you go. That's your third place team. Uh, so jug did not have all their players, uh, Bet Root could not play any longer. So, uh, wait, did I, I made the wrong team? Oh, no. Uh, oops. So, discard that. <laughs> All right, so uh, that was an accident. I guess I made the wrong... I, oh, it's Force Win, not Force Quit. Okay. Well, hey, you live and you learn. Uh, go to game. So, oh, okay, so it's Force Win. So we want to force them to win. God, I'm terrible at this. L. Darren needs to stop telling me to do this. I told you guys, I'm not very bright. But what I do have is a uh, Rascal Gene, or Rathal, Rascal High Reef Gaming, rather. Uh, and this game, too. On control points for Farming Complex. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. And let's try to make chat a good place to be. Very beautiful game. Oh, th uh, that game literally can't go any better. But uh, Gene does get third place. Uh... So, uh, good to know. Spazy says he did not play for two minutes, so. I mean, he played, he just didn't do much because he was lagging. That's fair. Classic Shuri, hey, I told you I'm not very small. No, uh, I thought it's, I thought it was a forced quit. I'm sorry. I fixed it. As long as I fixed my mistakes, we're good, right? Okay, so, uh, let's see what they can get going. Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, they're they're saying things, so I'm just gonna let them say that. Uh, and Apex has to hit ready. Is he there? Uh, if we leave the game. Uh, okay. Uh, Apex, where you at, buddy? Okay, game starting. Sorry, I, I have to make sure everyone hits ready so I don't make them start without me, without them wanting to kind of thing. But uh, Five, also, four, just so you guys know, I've been very sick two, and uh, have not gotten around to it. Uh, yes, it is best of seven, but uh, I've been sick and hadn't gotten around to it. But I have footage from Apex from the last week's tournament that I will be uh, posting uh, against Back to Back and Joe. So it, it, it's good, good stuff. So. I'll get that out sometime this week. AK over there getting the elimination. He wants to go take on everyone, but he can't. Uh, okay, so what is what is he doing? Okay, so he's going around, trying to position himself for his team. That makes sense. Uh, Tuzak's not able to get B. Rob's not able to get C. Okay, so he's going to come out and make sure he protects A, but can he do it? He can. And he realizes that his rocket can't do anything there, so he tries to turn around. That was insane. Jules has the speed to do that. And then he gets Beerus with a sniper close range. And there's that guy behind him. He realizes it just a little too late, though. And his team is still in the game, though. Like, So whatever he did worked. 
Lord Beerus is able to take out one. Can he take out two, Zek two? Spazy's there to help him. Okay, so you got Armenia. Oh, they're about to three cap him. Okay, so what can we do here? I have no idea, but I just want close games. I don't really care who wins, but we need to see what Tuzak can do. Can Tuzak kill AK up in the top? He, oh, he makes Tuzak go. Oh, okay. We've got Rocket does actually get three people low for his team. So, uh, or two people, not three, but uh, Spazy with the double, AK with the triple. Okay, I guess it wasn't Spazy. I thought it was above his head, but he ends up dying right after the triple. But what a beautiful triple by him. And then you have Apex and Armenia kind of trading it out. Rob's able to get a kill with that lethal Orion. But then you have Jules getting the double. Can he go for a triple here? Oh, he can't. Spazy and Beerus kind of sandwich him in. And remember, uh, th this is one of the best teams in the world who practices this stuff. So th it shows. Practice shows at times like this. That that's a fact. Can Rob try to get that triple or at least make it into a killing spree? He ends up going at Spazy, almost gets him, but Spazy ends up getting the perfect aim. Jules able to get the kill and the hill. Can he go B? They, if they can make this trip cap work, Jules gets a blade master and he's trying to take out B, but he's got so many fire. Oh, he actually gets out of it. He kills him too. Jules is just on another level. Oh my God. To be able to do that is insane. So let's follow Beerus, the number one player of every game that he's ever been in. <laughs> At least the every game I've been in. God. Okay, so what's he doing? Oh, he's actually making the smart play of just going around. And Tuzak, he actually gets Tuzak. His teammate's there to help him too. And this should close out the game. But he actually gets killed by Apex there. Armenia doesn't let it stay though. And then, oh, okay. Oh, you actually have Armenia getting taken out by Rob, and then uh, everybody fires off rockets because there's 30 seconds, or three seconds left. Well. And again, Lord Beerus is number one. Um, Lord Beerus has super hacker mode on. Uh, actually, just to be very clear, he does not hack. But what he does is, you saw where he was very patient, and he ran underneath to go behind him. And he got like three kills from that. That he would have never got. And most people would have ran to somebody. But he actually goes through. And uh, gets. Like he just does things very smart. Basically. He thinks everything through. And so even though it takes him longer to get that first kill. He gets three kills. Instead of running straight in and trading out his one life and one death. And so that's why he gets so many kills. That's why he gets so many points. And he is the best at it. Like, um, so Elevate versus Rascal. I don't know, man. Elevate did play Rascal a bunch back before they were Rascal, back when they were Black Bulls. And I think Elevate pretty much dominated them most of the time. Uh, maybe not dominated, but they won most of the matches by a high percentage. So, uh, even if they're close matches, they won them. So, uh, I would go Elevate, but Gentrix has told me, or not me, but told Venom, who told me. That he's not coming back. So no matter what, Gentrix is gone. And Gentrix is really the heart and soul of that team, if you ask me. Uh, Venom does a lot of the work, but uh, Gentrix filled in all the holes. He was basically an all-around guy that could pretty much do anything. And whenever you needed a sniper, whenever you needed a rusher in any situation, you could adapt to any team because of Gentrix. And without that, I don't know if that team actually does as well. So uh, I don't know. Uh, it, it's hard to say, but, uh, old elevate definitely going to get rascal to lose, but, uh, elevate of what they can be now. I don't know. Shit. Do that. <laughs> okay. Okay. We got, we got some, uh, clan clan stuff going. So, uh, <laughs> let's see what happens. Lord Beerus game sense exactly. Uh, that, that's exactly what it is, and uh, he's basically put in there to be a main slayer to get his points for his team. Uh, his team's selfless too, and that is one of the biggest things most people don't have is they don't want to be selfless. Uh, they want to be the guy to get points, or they just don't want to have no points. And uh, this Bulls team, look at that game sense. He just comes right behind him. He's able to get uh, space. He kills him, but he could add a double there from that. And Tuzak actually doing great. This is where Tuzak got his six at once. So 
on Rascal, so we'll see what happens there. And AK doing a great job with no help. So, oh, and all the rockets fly in. That was a great job. Oh, I don't think they capped the hill. They didn't. Oh, wow. What a good job by Lord Beers getting there in the last second to make sure that they don't cap the hill. And they are able to back cap, but Jules is not able to. Oh, Jules does actually take it back, but uh, not for his team. Okay. What can Apex do? He gets Armenia low for his team. Tuzak's able to get a double off of it. Can Tuzak go for the six at once again? I know he wants it. Okay, so he's got Lord Bears behind the bar doing work. Spazy's chasing Rob. He's already dead, though. Uh, and now he's got to contend with Jules. But can he do it? He actually outsnipes Jules. Okay. Spazy over there. Best rusher in the game. I swear by it. <laughs> Tuzak over here going for Armenia. Oh, he gets him. Oh, does he, he doesn't know about Spazy, though. Oh, it doesn't even matter. Oh, he ends up dying to Jules. What can Jules do off that? Let's see. Jules is doing it with his knife, and he actually gets Beerus with a knife as a sniper. That, that is very hard to do, as I can tell you. Uh, what is up, Destiny? How are you doing? Rascal is built very different. But hey, Hyreth is right there. This game is not out of reach. And just so you guys know, Saloon is Rascal's best map. So not the map you want to play them on, and Hyreth is doing a great job. Uh, but Rascal's best map happens to be Saloon, so not not where you want to play against them. But, oh, AK's able to get Apex in the middle. Tuzak's able to get that one. Oh, can Tuzak do more? He's low, but I've seen him do a lot low. Spazy with the double. Can he turn around and make that a triple? He has to. He's going to die from the burn damage. What a rocket by Spazy saving the hill for his team. That was a beautiful rocket. Even though he got the one kill, it doesn't even matter. It saved his team. And that is where it comes in. These guys are willing to get a single kill rocket because it knows it saves his team. Even if he got no kills, it would have saved it and he would have done it. And that's what it is, guys. It's all about winning and winning being the only goal. Not having 500 points, but just being the best in the world and winning. And right here, Spazy getting the one. Getting the two. He's going to go for Rob. Can he get it? Triple kill. Can he go for the four at once on Jules? Uh, he doesn't know where Jules is, so he can't. But Tuzak comes around. He ends up getting one, two, and then Armenia stops him for the triple. And then you have Rob up there getting an easy kill on Spazy. No, Spazy's alive. What is Spazy made of, guys? I, he best rusher in the world. Sorry if I screamed and that's loud. I don't know. I'm excited. That was nuts. Spa oh, AK over here waving, letting him kill him. That's kind of not cool, but whatever. <laughs> wow. Spazy is just... Oh, someone... Beerus, Beerus heard me. He He's worried that we're going to think he's hacking, so he got last on purpose. I know, what, I know what that is. But Spazy over there, 295. And we have at least one more game for you guys. Rascal is built very different. But we've had a ton of amazing games today. A bunch of very close ones. So no matter what, we have had a good day and a good stream. Today's not Armenia's day. He's lagging pretty hard. And Jules and Tuzak are not an easy combo to snipe against, guys. Uh, it, it's very, very hard to snipe against those two. It's hard to snipe against those two when they're the only like sniper. When you put both of them, like that's nuts. Uh... No, you got to remember only one of the games is close with Gene. And uh, then with this one, the Subway game is 1,000 to 900. So uh, 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 you've never played Subway or not Subway, but Saloon against them. That's the hardest thing in the world. See, I told you, I told you, Beerus, I told you guys, He, I told you he's listening. He turned off his hacks. Beerus, just so you know, that's the first time I've ever seen you get second. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, wait, was that four? That can't have been four. You guys have more, right? Let's see. Ongoing tournament. Why is it frozen? <laughs> I hate this website so much. Okay, here we go. Uh, brackets. Oh, no, I'm definitely kidding. Beerus doesn't act. Oh, no, that was four. Or, no, it's not four. Okay. Sorry, I, the site messed up. <laughs> but seriously, Beerus is the first time I've ever been in a game you didn't get first, so thank God. 
Thank God you can get not first. <laughs> All right, here we are. We are in game four. And it's Subway again. I think this is the same exact thing that happened the last time they played together. Um, I don't really know what's up with that, but it's kind of weird. And this is the one that was 1,900, so this is the one to watch. Uh, but again, Spazy, best rusher in the world. And again, you will have Armenia, Spazy, Lord Barris, Rob. Jules and Tuzak's uh, YouTube's linked in the description. So, uh... okay, there we go. Battle. So, uh, let's see what we can get going here. And again, Lord Beerus watching this so he can self spec. I am kidding. I have it on a 40 second delay. He can't do anything. He's just here to say hey because it's boring between the games. Uh, I did want to make sure that's blended out. <laughs> Uh, we do have the 40 second delay, so Beerus being in chat is not a problem. Uh, Rob over there actually gets a really good Orion off. Okay, can he take the hill from it? No, he's going to take Armini out first, and then he's going to go for it, and then he's going to take AK out. Rob wants to do it all by himself. Beerus able to rocket him, though. Apex able to rocket Beerus. Can Apex get it? He can't, but that's okay because his teammate should be able to clear it up before Beerus can do too much. And Beerus... Oh, what a move. And that right there, you ask why Beerus is so good. That's why. He had the patience to wait. And that is just so brilliant, the way he did that. And he came against two of the best players in the world to do that. So, And then Tuzak gets the elimination streak off of Jules' elimination streak. Or not Jules, but Tuzak, sorry. So, uh, so yeah. So, Lord Beerus running up. Can, what can he do here? He runs in their spawn. He ends up dying to Spazy, though. And okay, let's see what Rob's doing. Rob is dead. But Armenia is on a double kill. Armenia is on a triple kill. Can Armenia get the four? He's just spawn killing him. And he ends up dying, but Beerus is going back to help the spawn kill. And they're just going to push him back in the spawn. And okay, you have Apex. Oh, Apex is able to get AK. Can Apex turn it into anything? You have Spazy just sniping in the middle on the little head glitches doing it to perfection. He ends up seeing he's got a guy to his right, so he just does what he can to the left. That's a good move, but it ends up just not working out. Rascal, you have, oh, Lord Beerus going in there for the double. Can he get the triple on Apex? I think it's been too long. Oh, Apex with a brilliant double kill on AK and Lord Beerus. Can he get the triple? He gets the triple. He almost gets the four at once. Armenia is the lone guy in the hill. And okay, they can take the hill back here. Okay, you got Jules running around just trying to find people. Can he get Beerus? No. Okay, Rob does, though. And they have two people up on the sniper perch. They get them low. They have snipers from literally every angle, and Jules is able to get one of them. Oh, he sees Spazy drop down. Spazy's dead now, and Apex is alone in the hill, but he's low, and he's deadly. But Lord Beerus is able to get him. Spazy's rocket takes out Jules, and AK takes out Rob, and just blows up their setup. But they all spawn together, so that's good. It's going to be harder to spawn kill him. But Lord Beerus is going to try anyways and pretty much succeeds. Because Lord Beerus is one of the best players in the game. They have two of the best rushers there are. Uh, it, it's nuts, man. That rascal team is so good. And Tuzak's going over, trying to help his team, but the game's over. And what can you do at this point, right? And don't worry, after the stream, I will put in the links uh, any of these players that want their YouTube channels. Uh, even if you got out in the first round, if you played, I'll link your YouTube channel in the description. And go follow these guys. Guys, Tuzak has like 40 followers, or 40 subscribers. We need to, we need to change that. But let's make sure that that's not a thing. But let's make sure Tuzak gets some more followers. Lord Beerus, Armenia both have channels as well. We need to go show some love to those guys. They played a great game for you for basically just your entertainment. So, uh... We need to go and show them some love. Uh, J Kim's channel as well. Uh, anyone who played that wants their channel link, let me know. I'll do that. And uh, great games, guys. What a finals. And what a, what an entire stream, to be honest. All these games were great. The only games that weren't great were the ones that I accidentally like forced them into 2v4. So, uh, <laughs> Jewel stuck on the wrong team. Nah, Jewel, they... That's a hard team to play against for sure. 
But uh, I don't know, man. That first game was good, though. That first game, and then they made him play Subway twice for some reason. It says it's running. Wait, what map was that? Okay. Is it not over? Okay, there we go. It is over. All right, sorry. Sorry if we're getting confused. Challenger mode so slow. Congrats, guys. You all did amazing. Thank you, everyone who played. Thank you for everyone who watched. And I hope you all have a great day. Remember, their YouTube channels will be linked in the description. And go subscribe. Show some love. Uh, they, they did great. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Probably stream Monday. I'm not really sure. But uh, Lord Beerus, great games, bro. That guy does not hack. I showed you how he does it. His game sense is just next level. And uh, anyone who says any different, good for them. But uh, And again, Spacey, best rusher in the game. <laughs> we played the same max last week. Tell them they need to change it. I can do that, buddy. Uh, I'll see if we can change it up and like pick maps because some of these map groupings are kind of dumb. So I'll see if I can actually do it myself or uh, we'll just change things. Okay, guys. See ya.